Two. Right down to here. They just buried it. Everything you want. <laughs> <laughs> this thing is fucking huge. What is this? <laughs> is this the fucking fortress? <laughs> I think so. <laughs> Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> what is? Oh my god. <laughs> is it just me or is Ma Kent a little young? She is. Hello? come long arms I bless you. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think that's a language from Earth. No shit. Thank you, Detective. You rolled a natural 20. It looks more like Odin. <laughs> <laughs> We got Nick Fury Jarrell. <laughs> but, but wait but wait a second. Super Bay can't lift me in here. He's never been able to do that, I thought. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck's going on in this scene. <laughs> so, so I guess this <laughs> Go the ahead, must be the Kent must be dead. That's the old, yeah. This must be their death scene. Okay, so that explains yeah. it a little bit. Uh, oh. But why is Jarrell Nick Fury Odin? Maybe he got his his eye scratched by a flurkin. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe there's flurkins in the time. No, God. Why the hell is he wearing a cape? <laughs> That's a Superman thing. It's made from his baby blanket. God! Where do I come from? Where do I come from? <laughs> Maybe if Odin had actually thought to explain to things. You needed to come in early for some big surprise. Dial it back, Jimmy. Okay. Why is it so dark Two in here? things. Wait, don't look. I'm D doing the thing. Look, look, look. Boom. <laughs> Case closed. We need our conclusion to be backed by actual facts, Jimmy. No. A man flew down from the sky and risked his life to save us. A silhouette. Not for a reward or fame, but just because we needed help. That if I remember right, they had a clear view of him, too. He just had a hood up. Like... <laughs> oh, my gosh. <laughs> Yeah, so I'm curious if they're going to make Jimmy gay because the whole flame. Oh, you know they are. You know they are. Name bird is like <laughs> not really the best thing yeah. to call him. <laughs> <clears throat> but I don't know. You're right. I need to know. I, uh, I'm not feeling so great, though. It's maybe something I ate. Oh, I should take care of this. Uh, see you later. Come on, Jimmy. We're leaving, too. Wait, where are we going? Isn't you got another obvious? donut craving? We're going to find the woman who tried to kill us. Why? <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> Why are you home? Uh, did something happen? Are you okay? I'm fine. Why did you I let him leave? Used my powers <laughs> to save yeah, He's clearly not ready. They saw me. Oh, Clark. Can't even go through a door yeah, without they don't know it was me. Still way too freaking nice. I like him. Yep. Yeah, you do. I meant professionally, Jimmy. I don't like like him. Oh, then text him. What are you, 14? <laughs> now you do. <laughs> I can't. What's not to like about a boy digging up his childhood spaceship? It's the most natural thing in the world. Jonathan, Martha, get the hell out of the way. Go back to the house. Oh, good. I better go. <laughs> Well, at least he left. He's a smart one. Is it just me, or is this bigger than it used to be? It grew. You don't have to do this, Clark. Fucking organic food. This thing tries to change you or <laughs> hurt you. Or... I don't know what will happen, but 
I need to oh, find I out who I am. Oh, I the Sailor Moon transformation. Come long ye arms to father on. Jarrell, well, like you can teach here. him Kryptonian. Just like go back to my plan. You would have yes, already thought that through. Spirit, Next time open with that. Did you take me from my mother? Wait, are you? Clark, you're not that stupid. You'd be able to figure it out. If this is my past, then I. So we took the red pill, okay. They actually made the spit curl part of the transformation. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Alright, so we need to make a decision right now. What's that? Are we going with Sailor Man or Super Moon? <laughs> You know, I like yes, Super Moon. Yes, I, yes, I've been holding on to that for like three weeks now. That's fair. That's fair. <laughs> I think I like Super Moon. Super Moon? Okay. I think I like that. Super Moon it is. <laughs> oh, Super Moon with the power up. But you mean you mean to tell me a super advanced Kryptonian civilization couldn't come up with a, like, you know, a program to install the language? Or at least wouldn't have thought through, hey, that would be a problem we're going to run into. Let's hope hey, Morbius works. just gave him the red pill. <laughs> He's fine now. <laughs> uh, yeah, I thought they had technology that adapted to any planet's, like, you know, structure and, you know, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> language. I don't know. I, you know, apparently not. <clears throat> Jarrell doesn't have a cape. It would serve no purpose. Kryptonian on Krypton. They yeah. can't fly. He doesn't hey, have... ca hey, capes are like bow ties. They're just cool. <laughs> <laughs> Everything looks cool with cape. <laughs> <laughs> Haven't they watched The Incredibles? Oh, man. Yeah, Jarrell doesn't have a cape. He damn sure doesn't have a fucking eye patch. I don't know what's going on. No idea. I'm here for it. Don't worry, I'm still me, Ma. I'm still your son. Of course. I really not. don't like their Superman but logo. Else now, too. Yeah, I don't really care what for it either. Lowest... It suits you. But I think this needs something more. A belt? Definitely shorts. Come with me. I am the smartest one here. Ah! Ah! Is that supposed to be live wire? Clark, you can move fast enough. You can get out of the way. Hello, <clears throat> Miss. Are you all right? Yes. Uh, do you have a comment for the Daily Planet? <laughs> Clark, there's the one shot this chick. Yeah, really. What are we doing here? Yeah. <laughs> I guess now she's going to die. Will you make up your mind as to how vulnerable he is to electricity, please? See what happens I'm when you don't take the shot, I'm Super Moon. Are you okay? And now, Superman. Since when does he read minds? This must be something new. Why weren't you that fast before? <laughs> <laughs> oh, now. Chandler okay. Jameson a little bit there, aren't you? I mean, I'm I'm okay with it. I think. I mean, hey, oh, Lois. He's not completely empathetic, so. So is the suit itself like uh, nanotech? Like, he changed 
Okay, so he does change out of it. We made the front page! <gasps> Read the byline. By Cat Grant, Ronnie Troop, and Steve Lombard. What? <laughs> okay. <laughs> um, in some ways, a little better than the last time. In other ways, a lot, lot worse. Yeah. <laughs> Yep. That's the perfect way of describing this episode. Yeah. Okay, first of all, Perry would not let the let somebody scoop the byline. He's like he doesn't take credit for people's work and he doesn't let anybody steal credit. That's like not his thing. No, it's not. I'm not even like a huge Superman fan, and even I know that. Uh, the relationship between Lois and Clark is way, way too fast. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I was going to say, it's a little accelerated, I feel, um, for this show. I mean, this is a kid show and all, and honestly, if, like, Jimmy didn't pop up, they would have probably slept together in episode two. <laughs> like, let's be honest here. <laughs> uh, that's true. This is This is very true. Yeah. And you mean to tell me me mega genius Kryptonian mind Jarrell wouldn't have thought, hey, my son won't be able to understand what we're saying because he's going to, you know, a different planet. <laughs> you are correct, though, TC. That, that, uh, that was live wire. So that was live wire. Okay. Yeah, that was... Huh. Um. So, wait, just a do you think the dude with the really weird hair is supposed to be like Proto Deathstroke? I don't know. I don't know. I thought he was uh, that guy. Um, gosh, what's his name from? I'm drawing a blank. It's from like the Suicide Squad movies. Deadshot. No, the uh, the guy who was like recruiting the people for Amanda Waller. Oh yeah, I know what you're talking about. I can't think of his name though. Yeah, but I know what you're talking about. Yeah, uh, Rick Flag. Yes, Flag. Yeah, maybe it's some variation or version of Flag. It's probably not. Right. Maybe they also seem very inconsistent with how much like punishment Clark could handle. Like he flew through Live Wire's electrical shield without even like it didn't even phase him. Uh, and then he gets like he's brought to his knees by an electric shock. I'm like, no, like pick one of the two. Either it hurts him. Yeah, pick a direction and go. <laughs> yeah, it's it, it's it's like they the writers don't know how to write. So I'm getting the um, I'm getting the gist that like they want to write like a Superman, like obviously in his earlier years, right? But I feel like they're they don't know how to write him an inexperienced version of him because, like you said, there's like inconsistencies between you know what he can take, what he cannot, how fast he moves, when he uses his strength, when he doesn't. It's like you know there's different things that he's using that you know I can do to what is going on in the show and then it's not I don't know it's 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 very inconsistent like I don't think they really have it down when it comes to how to write you know a younger inexperienced version of Superman because really he should be soloing these fucking people I mean if we're being honest so yeah he should have been able to one shot live wire yeah and, and I mean that's just with what we've seen established yeah yeah like I'm not even taking other continuities into account. His speed alone, he should be able to one-shot her. Yeah, I don't know why they didn't reference... Well, I do know why, but this is like would have been so easy just to reference like Superman the Animated Series or even the Justice League Animated Series. <laughs> like, it's not... Like, everything you needed was like right there. It's a fucking layup. Like, I don't understand why... I don't know. Because they shoot free throws. Like it, is de it, is, it is death stroke. <laughs> it is death stroke. <laughs> oh, it is death stroke? Yeah. Agent Slade Wilson. 
Oh, okay. Oh, man. Okay, so that's who that's supposed to be. Oh, is that why his hair was... Oh, yeah, Agent to... Slade. Yeah, I see it now. Yeah. In the, in the, in the credits there, yep. Uh, is that why a piece of his hair was covered, like covered one of his eyes like an asshole? Yeah. <laughs> it's like, oh, hey, it's what's Deathstroke ever. Haven't these people watched Arrow? Like, we have the perfect death stroke. Yeah. Like, <laughs> that is one thing that Arrow did right. They had the perfect guy f- guy for him. That is true. That is They very nailed true. that down they did. perfectly. They, really did. they will never find another actor as good as him. Honestly, I don't know. You guys probably didn't watch Titans, but um, there was a live animated, the live action version on HBO Max. And uh, the second season actually had a death stroke. And I would say he actually did. I forgot what the actor's name was, but he actually portrayed him really fucking well. Oh, my sub- sub- yeah. yeah. My subscription ran out before I could get to that show. So well, if, no, I, if I ever good. get it back, I'll go back to it. It's good that it did. But <laughs> yeah, season season two with the death stroke storyline, I thought was actually pretty, pretty fucking solid. So. Yeah. It I, ran out literally right before they dropped Velma, so I was in a good place at that point. So fair enough. <laughs> uh, but I, I still I can't get over the fact that Perry let them get let somebody just blatantly steal credit. Do they yeah. not know how who Perry is? <laughs> Obviously not, because people at the at at the planet lose their job for that. Exactly. Like, I, I I think you got it right, uh, Chaos. Like they genuinely think he's Jameson. Yeah. And it's like. Yep, that's how they wrote so. it. I mean, he's he's, he's like, I don't like. Why are you telling me this? I don't care. Get out of my office. Like, all that we're missing is is the laugh, and we're all sad. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's like, come on, people. Wrong IP here. <laughs> yeah. Wrong universe. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> oh, man. It's not going to translate for this oh. Superman. Okay. So we also run into the fact that they do, the Kents are, in fact, alive, which means there's no justification for him even being in Metropolis with how incompetent he was in the previous episode. Correct. Yep. Yep. <laughs> also, I'm under the guise that there is no fortress. Is that just not going to be a thing in this show? Is it literally in the corn crops of uh, Smallville? Is that what's going on? You, you, they do realize that they were supposed to hide the ship, right? Like that, That's part of it. They have to hide the ship because people can come looking. Well, they did. The ship grew. That's what it, it, it grows now. So, hmm. How does that make any sense? <laughs> I, I mean, mean you know. wouldn't, it, w- I mean, <laughs> wouldn't people be a little bit suspicious? Why is there this big massive hole in the middle of a cornfield? Yeah, it's like where corn doesn't grow. Like I get people believe in the whole like corn circles and that, but you gotta draw the line somewhere. Yeah, that thing was like blatantly obvious. Like everything yeah. around it was like teeming with life, and you had this um, big ass fucking empty spot. <laughs> I mean, fill it with water, make it look make it look like a lake or something. Yeah. Build a barn on top of it. Oh, I don't yeah. know. <laughs> and you know what else? What do they attribute crop circles to? Freaking aliens. Aliens. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's not really incognito. There. No. No, it's it's like putting a sign up say, yeah, here's the target. Like alien buried here. Alien tech right here. Yeah. Let me get it. Yeah. But why was Jorel able to fly? He wouldn't have bothered. I don't First know. Maybe he- it was just his hologram. I don't fucking it's the fact the fact that he's wearing a cape. Like I, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> and yeah. he has a tie patch the taboo. I I don't fucking know. Well, yeah, what were they going for with that? Earnestly, why? They wanted a Jarrell that's been through some shit. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I was I was waiting for him to literally pull out like 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 what was the act called Warbringer? Yeah. <laughs> Like holding an axe at the same time. I aim for the head. <laughs> it's not enough to know his story. He's got to like look like he's been through some shit too. Yeah. <laughs> oh man. I'm 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 terrified to see what the show will do with Zod if he ever shows up. Oh my. Uh, God. I mean that that would make some sense as to how he would lose his eye. That's probably what they were going for. Yeah. Zod probably 
They fought. Somehow the scientists beat the ultimate trained soldier. Um, just like in uh, Man of Steel. Uh, <laughs> yeah, it's on brand. There it is. Huh? I, like I always say, 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 everybody rolls. Everybody rolls a natural twenty. Uh, you know, it, it happens. <laughs> yeah, that is, <laughs> yeah, that's true. I do know that Brainiac does make an appearance. I believe in this show. So, mm. yeah, we'll see. Um, I don't really like the costume, even even beyond the. Even beyond the uh, Sailor Moon trans, oh Super Moon transformation, uh, just kind of eh. Yeah, I don't really like the S. Yeah, is what I just really not a fan of that. So, I also didn't like how on his shirt when he's a boy, he also has like a one of those S's that you could. Yeah, like, I saw that. Yeah, you were a kid. <laughs> like, yeah, it's like we already know who he is. Like we get it. Like. Yeah, you don't have to foreshadow and, that. Yeah, and, and, plus, and plus, the reason kids wore S shirts was because Superman was around. Yeah. 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 <laughs> exactly. Yeah. I, I, I don't know where they're going with that. But I don't know. I think your description, you said, you know, it's it's better than the last. It's, it's, would you say, how did you describe this episode? I said better than the previous episode right. in some ways, much it's worse dope. than others. Correct. Yeah. <laughs> what was it? I was talking to somebody. It might have been UTC when I, um, um, who I was talking to, but I was like, if he gets the suit from um, the dog for crypto, I would literally lose it because of the way that like Sailor Moon becomes Sailor Moon because of Luna, the right. cat. Right. I would have like literally lost it if it was a dog that came in the suit. <laughs> yeah, I would have been out. <laughs> yeah, I would have been like, yeah, I'm done. I yeah. can't do this anymore. Yeah. <laughs> Guaranteed somebody in that writer's room thought that they should do that. Guaranteed. Oh, that yeah. I have no doubt. And I yeah. guarantee that that some people were like, you know what? That is that is awesome and terrible at the same That's time. Awesome. Yeah. <laughs> and there are definitely also moments where I'm not sure who it's who this show is written for. Is it written for a kid's audience? Because some of the stuff was very like obviously juvenile. But then again, like you had them nearly making out in episode two. Yeah. Like that. What? Why? <laughs> Make up your mind, guys. Yeah, yeah, it's like everything except for that one scene. Why is this on Adult Swim? Correct. Yeah. Like <laughs> yeah. this is on Adult Swim because they didn't they didn't believe in it enough to have like the attention of children, which should say a lot. It should. Yeah. It definitely should. Yeah. You know, I actually, I I am enjoying this more than uh, Gotham Knights. I will say, <laughs> I will say that. I don't know if it's because I just really don't have anything vested in Superman. Like, I like him, but just really not invested. But, or these shows are, like, super short. So, <laughs> Well, there's you know. that. Plus, we actually have some things, some good things to say about yeah. this show. Yeah, I there. mean, they're there small, was nothing. They, there was uh, nothing good about Gotham Knights at all. We were. <laughs> it was everything like, why, why, God, why. <laughs> you know what? I will tell you what, what was good about it. You want to know one thing that was good about it? It ended. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> and it did not get renewed. That's the best thing. <laughs> Two good things. Yeah. About Gotham Knights. So. <laughs> Oh man! All right, guys, you got anything else you want to talk about about this episode number two? Jonathan is Jonathan confuses me. That's one one last thing. It's like sometimes he's really really smart, and other times he's like, "Oh, you gotta like the ship did almost kill your mother, but you gotta keep looking." Yeah, <laughs> yeah. He just, he like, just it's like he's just kind of just there for the ride. His character <laughs> in this show, yeah. he's just kind of. He's just kind of, oh, yeah, I'm here. I'm dead. You know, it's just. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's how I'm just getting that vibe from him in this. <laughs> so. Yeah, my biggest, it's not even a real complaint about Martha. And nobody take this the wrong way because, you know, I 
I ha I have I have respect for mothers everywhere. But with the age difference, it's it's almost like she was like a like like a gold digger or something. <laughs> I I I noticed that too. I mean, I don't know if I would say gold digger, but I did notice that. I'm like, she's really young for him. Yeah, there's a subst. Yeah, it's like on the level of like the age difference between the original Aunt May and the MCU Aunt May. Right. It's like ridiculously different. Like, unless they were going, unless they were going for blonde, and it just looked gray because of the distance. No, maybe in his hair, Perhaps. maybe. I don't know. Perhaps. Yeah, we'll just go with that because I was like, "This isn't okay." I have, I have issue with this. <laughs> yeah. They like really de aging a few characters in this show. And we do have confirmation that Lois is in fact an intern, just like Jimmy, and she has yep. like three days more experience. Yep. <laughs> we got to We got to get Jimmy on like a, on like a decaf trip. Yeah, he is just he was, a liar. He was worse than he was worse than the previous episode, believe it he, or not. Yeah, he was. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, he's gotta he's gotta tone it down just a little. Like yeah. just a little, man. Oh man. And I appreciate that he's trying to be a good wingman for his friend, but again, dial it back. Yeah. 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 It's like like put in your, you know, put your word in and then, you know fall back <laughs> like you know there's not a lot to being a wingman so. yeah you gotta let clark do some of the work <laughs> like there you go <laughs> <laughs> there you go <laughs> oh man yeah yeah he's pushing them together when as far as we know they they've met each other literally yesterday <laughs> they just really like each other which again, that's literally not how it's supposed to work. She's supposed to be kind of a bitch. Yeah, she is. <laughs> <laughs> she, yeah. She, uh, she's supposed to practically jump out a window and, you know, figure it out. And then from there on, it's, you know, life is good. <laughs> I, also, I also think she's supposed to be like, I feel like she'd be savvy enough not to um, try and do an interview while he's getting shot at with electricity. Yeah, but this is supposed to be a younger version of her, so you know she's not. She doesn't have that experience. She's so she's so starstruck. Mm. You know, this isn't. I mean, most, this is the most thing we know. Youth isn't supposed to be an excuse for absolute stupidity. Well, sometimes to America. It is. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. I uh, <laughs> I would say TikTok would say hold my beer. So. Yeah. <laughs> Hi, I'm Agent of Chaos, and welcome to Jackass. <laughs> oh, man. oh man! Well, fellas, looking forward to episode three. Ironically enough, um, the only person they really damaged in this, they, they actually did more damage to Perry and the Kents, yeah. uh, John and Martha, than any other character in the show. Just by the mere fact that Clark is in Metropolis and Perry, for whatever reason, pulled the Jameson. Yeah. Yeah, I would try to say those are the two biggest things. That and what they did to Jarrell. So, yeah. I thought we were about to get some, uh, some. I don't know. You, I don't know if you guys have. You guys seen the Mummy, right? Have you guys seen that? Yeah, long, long, long time ago. Yeah, yeah. It like some of the shit he was saying. The Kryptona reminded me of uh, that spell book. And the the chick who was saying the spell. She's like, yeah, Karishma, Karishma, Paragus. I'm like, what the fuck is going on, Jarrell? I'm like, is he gonna try to <laughs> rip his heart out with Kali bars? <laughs> <laughs> I just Jarrell's smarter than that. At least smart enough to know Clark isn't gonna know Kryptonian. And he would he would have planned that out. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> they didn't think of that stuff. Especially since he can apparently impl implant knowledge of Clark's past. 
Yeah, well, just, we just give him the knowledge, give him yeah. the language. Yeah, just download it like the Matrix and call it good. I call mean, it, exactly. That's what they it's did like, in Smallville. Yeah. So many things to reference they could have used to better this show. <laughs> so many things. I mean, they already gave Clark Clark the freaking red pill earlier. Like, yeah. <laughs> and, and Jarrell even seems confused. That's the other thing. Like, you genuinely seem surprised. Oh, wait, you don't know what I'm saying? It's like, of course he doesn't. You're not that stupid, Jarrell. Yeah. (laughs) (laughs) I'll give it a five. Yeah, I would say it's pretty, it was pretty mid. Yep. I'd say probably about a five at the most. Yeah. Well, if that's if that's it, then I will uh, take us out. Sounds good. All righty. Well, we uh, thank you guys for tuning in. We do ask that you smash that like button, subscribe, leave a comment, let us know what you guys think. Hit that bell for notifications. Share this video out there, and you guys take care. Bye, everybody. See you later.